while building a business it is humanly impossible to acquire all the skills and uh, if you look at the flip side outsourcing everything is also not a great option you can't literally be outsourcing everything so you have to find a middle path here the middle path here is that you need to at least have some understanding of the core skills that will be required to build the business so for example if you are a edtech founder you need to have at least some understanding of education education delivery course creation and let us say some sort of technology but then of course when you are into very very early stages you can't be knowing everything so you should do two things one get right co-founders on board who have the right skill set but again collectively as the co-founders you will not be knowing everything and this is where second things come into the picture that outsource those things that you do not know yes in a few cases you will not have the right money to kind of even outsource and in that case time becomes your friend so then you trade off your time over money learn a few things at least that will help you to get started that is how even i and my co-founder neha when we were building code design labs in the beginning around like six seven years back that is what we did right so she never had the understanding of it skills or i never had the understanding of finance skills and there were a couple of other things we had no idea about and honestly never even had money to kind of you know literally outsource everything so we spent time learn those basic stuff and kind of at least uh, got the basic understanding of how to kind of navigate through that path so at least when we're outsourcing we at least know the basics the reason why outsourcing fails in most of the cases is because neither you know what you want and then you completely rely on the agency or the freelancer and because of this you not doing what you want and the freelancer doing whatever they want right this creates a lack of trust and also creates a lack of objective outcome right so both the parties do not have clarity on what they're looking for and therefore you as a founder your expectation is do everything right and then this guy because they don't have clarity in their head what is that you're looking for whatever they do they think they're doing their best job and then that completely creates lack of understanding and, and because of this the expectation mismatch happens and eventually the project fails so this is the reason why at least having some basic understanding of the core skill set that are very very critical to your business operations and some idea about the basic skill set that you might be outsourcing or otherwise business functions in general you should as a founder have basic understanding of those uh, until and unless you're not going to build a second layer of leadership uh, till then you should know at least the basic things that are the part of your business operations i hope you like the advice shared in this video if you found it valuable please make sure to like the video and subscribe to the channel we make content on startup and entrepreneurship on a weekly basis. I would also recommend you to share it. And if you are a startup founder and have any questions about your startup journey, feel free to leave them in the comments below. I'll be happy to pick them up in my next video.